off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hey folks Want to join me for a very non-adventureful day? <laughs> I want to show you something so cute. We just love looking at our backyard now. And uh, Kaylee gave us a new addition. This is her latest little ceramic project from school that she brought home. Actually, her final one. It's a little dish. Um, it actually has like a whole bunch of ideas um, that she wants to put things in there. <laughs> but I thought it was too cute to not like display. And it looks really good with like the color of... The tray and then it's just kind of a conversation piece um, yesterday it did rain for a good chunk of the day so we kind of had everything pulled up and in so that these didn't get wet even though they are like waterproof I just wanted to like kind of protect them as long as we could so we kind of pulled them in but like this edge I don't know if it got wet over here everything is kind of dried off now but um, anyway, and I let this kind of sit out into the rain as well, move it back over, but I wanted to get it like some fresh rain. I watered it Saturday, so then I got some rain yesterday, but it's just kind of fun, um, to have the table. In fact, I don't know if it's going to rain again, so I can pull this table back out. We had tucked it all back in, which is nice because you can just move everything around easily <laughs> and then just tuck everything all back in it's kind of nice I I don't know I love it um, had it not been freezing cold out here yesterday we would have actually spent a really nice Sunday afternoon what day was it yesterday was it Sunday yesterday it was not it was Monday <laughs> today is Tuesday today's Tuesday but I just I always keep coming over here now I leave my curtains open unless it's like super hot because I like to look out here. I like to look out here now. It's like, it's like, I don't know, magazine worthy in my mind because it's never looked that nice out there. But I've been working on a project for church um, this morning and I worked on it again last night. Um, we're having a 4th of July flag raising ceremony and we have done this flag raising ceremony um, at our church for decades, I believe. They've been doing it for a really long time. Um, I guess I can, I don't know. Our church information is public information. Um, I don't know, but I created this cute little uh, flyer for that. I don't know if the guy that asked me to do it, if he wanted it laminated, but I laminated it um, just in case, because he's gonna put these up around our church building, but he also said he wanted to put them up around town because it is a public event. He wants to bring people to a nice patriotic flag raising and we have cinnamon rolls and chocolate milk and juice and they've been doing it for decades and um, the community knows about it. Like we've had the mayor come before, we've had like, you know, city officials come and it's kind of a big deal, but I've been getting that ready to go. Um, he's got um, a copy to uh, print out front and back in order to make the flyers for that. But I am going to print out um, a few more of the big full size ones. Honestly, like if I had had more time and he had given me more budget, which technically I think we probably would have had more budget to do it, I would have actually like done it more professionally and I would have sent images to Costco and had them printed out in actual like um, photocopy images and then like big poster boards and whatnot but he didn't want to do that so I can't go beyond that myself um, so that's what I've been doing today I was working on it last night but I haven't pulled my bad boy out I haven't pulled out my treadmill and it's pretty cold outside it's supposed to get kind of sunny this afternoon. I'm kind of hoping maybe I can go for a walk this afternoon. Um, but you can see I'm wearing a sweatshirt again. <laughs> I just hate it. We had such good weather. It is supposed to get nice again starting this afternoon through the end of the week. Um, and so I'm kind of hopeful of that. 
Um, let's see what else have, have we been doing. Um, I'm trying to convince Jason. Uh, let me put you down here. We were at Costco twice yesterday. <laughs> uh, we went for a regular grocery run and it was very non um, climactic because we are just getting milk. Not even eggs. We got milk, bread, cottage cheese. No, we didn't even get that. Like it was so minimal <laughs> that it was kind of silly. Um, and then we had to go back again because our friend's dog died. And you guys, I've had four friends, including um, our friend's brother lost their dog. Four people that I know have had their pet pass away unexpectedly. I mean, I guess it's unexpected no matter what, but four in the past three days. That's kind of weird. <laughs> and they have like other friends of mine and they've had other friends of theirs have their dogs pass away. So I'm like, what is in the water, people? Anyway, so we had gone back to Costco yesterday for the second time. Um, and I just out of, ah, oh, here's my tweezers. I need, I need these from the car for the chin hairs. You, if you know, you know. So we had gone back to Costco for the second time to just get flowers to send to my friend and, or take over to my friend because she lost her dog. And I was like, let's just go look at the TVs because I want a TV in my room so bad. But it means that I have to rearrange half of the room and it means we have to get rid of the giant table upstairs. After I work out, work out, work, blah, blah, blah. After I work out, I will take you up there and I'll show you if you are new, which a lot of you are. Um, it's a, it, we're in a kind of a kerfuffle with our bedroom and it's not for any reason that you would ever expect. I promise you. You will not expect to see what we have in our bedroom. If you are new, <laughs> you're gonna have your mind blown. Um, but I really wanted TV in my bedroom and I had him like so close, so close. He was gonna take the TV off the shelf and he was gonna let me have it. And he was getting excited for himself and he's like, these TVs are cheap. We don't need anything fancy. They're like 250 bucks, not a big deal because I've Kind of got him on a little spending spree right now because we can, because it's fine. And um, all of a sudden he was like, the internet doesn't work in our room. And then what are we going to do with cable? I'm not signing up for more cable boxes. <laughs> My heart just fell. And I was like, honey, how much do you love me? And he was like, no, 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 you can just watch. Because the TV itself comes with like all the Roku stuff. It comes with Netflix and Hulu and Disney Plus and YouTube and comes with all that stuff in the TV now, so you don't even have to buy the Roku like we have on our other two TVs. And he was like, but you don't go to your bedroom to watch those things on TV. You use your phone to do that from bed. You use the TV to watch your housewives and your reality TV and your Vanderpump. It's <laughs> like, yes. And he's like, you need cable for that. I'm not buying another cable box. So then I had him like checking the cable that's here in our office and all well, the internet here in our office try and like and then the cable box upstairs and the cable outlet that's in our bedroom and trying to see if he can split it from the cable like from the actual power box in the laundry room I had him like doing all these things yesterday because I was like please 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 and now we're looking into Starlink <laughs> all of these things like to make I don't have any internet that works in my bedroom so I can't put the TV in there and I don't have cable in there. And even if he can split it and make it the cable run to our bedroom, I don't have internet in there. And it sucks so bad. We are always this close, but all the logistics isn't gonna work out. I'm gonna try and figure it out. I'm gonna try and figure it out. But for right now, I gotta get on the treadmill. Do you know what I just found underneath my little desk tray thing that rises up? I had had to start this documentation of all of my phone calls with Abby's surgeon and her orthodontist and like this time frame. And I thought it was like a, like a snafu in the surgery scheduling, like portion of having Abby have surgery. I didn't know at that time when I first started making initial calls and finding out that her surgery was going to get canceled. I didn't realize that it wasn't just a technicality, um, that like, she didn't want to schedule it or the surgeon wanted to cancel or that they didn't have availability during the summer. 
I didn't realize it was an actual physical thing. And so I was starting to like document all these phone calls and go back and look at appointments and, and anyway, all this stuff. And I was hiding it underneath my desk right here because I was terrified of Abby finding it. Because <laughs> it was before we told her about it. I didn't want her to find out about it. So it was tucked underneath there. But eventually, as you guys know and heard, I started to get the story pieced together little by little and I didn't end up needing to like prove a case, you know? And so anyway, it's kind of bringing that right back to me. All right, I've only gotten <laughs> a mile in so far, only 0.73 miles um, on the actual treadmill, uh, but a mile for the day. <laughs> I've walked a ton around the house, a quarter mile. Um, my friend just came over and picked up all the um, flyers that I made for him. I was able to laminate a couple more copies for him to hang up around the church or around town. But right before he got here, Abby texted and she's done with her state testing. She refuses to stay at school. <laughs> she's like, I don't need to be here. There's no class, to be fair. And there's nothing else for them to do. Super recycle would not take that box. So dumb. We packed our recycling can full of all those boxes from all of our furniture and stuff. And normally if you set a box like on the side, um, they'll take it and they refuse to take it. And I'm like, come on people. They even didn't take our yard waste last week. And so had to, we couldn't like fill it up more. Anyway, so I'm gonna go pick up Abby and then she doesn't know it yet, but I have a few errands to run on my way home. I have YouTube money to cash out and put into my savings fund. You guys don't even know what I'm saving for yet. Um, I have not talked about that yet. Have I talked about that? I don't think I have. I think I'm waiting until I know I can spend it. No, I have enough. So I haven't talked about that, but it is not Hawaii. Sadly, I am not saving for Hawaii yet which is kind of not a good thing. I need to actually start saving for that. Surprisingly, given the amount that I saved up spending money wise for our trip to Hawaii this last time we went, which was literally last month, I spent the whole year saving up that money. I saved up $3,000, but it took me all year long to save up. And so far since Right before we went on our trip to Hawaii, I started not putting money into that savings account or saving fund or whatever for Hawaii and putting it into this new fund for something that I'm saving for. And in just two months, I have been able to save over $3,000. And I'm so excited. I think with today's money and a scan, like the ultrasound scans that I do, we're supposed to getting, be getting paid for that soon. I think I'll be closer to $4,000, but I'm not even halfway there. At least I don't think I'm halfway there. And yes, it's something really, really big that I'm saving up for. And yes, I'm egging you on. <laughs> yes, I am. Okay, just picked up Abby. We're gonna risk it and park in the five minute parking spot. I, we're, we are out of face wipes and it's driving all of us crazy. And I haven't gone up to Marshall's to stock up on them and look for them on clearance because I haven't been going to Marshall's. So we're just going to get them from the dollar store because they're so cheap here. All right, forgot to film. We ran to Target too. Abby got her beloved um, goldfish that they don't sell in large quantities. What kind is it? Vanilla cupcake? Yeah. And we got some more chocolate pudding for our Ninja Creamies. But I also found some sugar-free ones for myself. And then I got Jason some ham. I'll stock up on that at the grocery store. That was at Target. And then I found these Nobleman men's wipes, <laughs> the manly ones, mainly because I only found three. I only found three wipes in this size. The other size I have is like 25 count. And I'd like to get everything, you know, a bang for my buck, quite literally. So I'll take the extra seven wipes <laughs> for these ones. So that's kind of our little haul. And the sun has come out officially. So I think I'm gonna 
have a little small bite to eat. And well, I made chicken salad yesterday, um, but I don't think I want to get that full. So I might have a light snack. And then I think I'm gonna get out and just walk in my neighborhood because when I take Chelsea to, no, oh, yeah, Chelsea has an activity tonight and I'm hoping Ashley does too, but I might walk when I'm waiting for them instead of just sitting in my car. So I might walk a couple miles here in my neighborhood and then take a break when the kids get home from school and yeah, go from there. Found a Wendy's bag from our trip when we came home from Hawaii. Um, got fast food on our way home from the airport. But I also forgot that I got a privacy pouch just to put little feminine products in, in your purse. And I have one here in my like console now, but I thought I would put one in my purse um, just so I can have them for me or for anyone who happens to be in my car. You know what I mean? There's lots of girls in her house, so. I think, since the sun is shining, I'm gonna go out there and enjoy, whoops, looks like Haley was already out here. She's gonna get the fire pit ready for tonight, but I think I'm gonna go sit on the couch and enjoy the sunshine. At least enjoy being outside. Forgot to show you the cute flowers that I bought myself yesterday when we went to get my friends some flowers. I should have got one of these ones. They turned out so pretty. This one's kind of mushed from the packaging, but they are very pretty, very summery, even though we're not quite to summertime around here. Um, but I did just make myself a little sandwich, a little uh, chicken salad sandwich with some grapes on it. Yes, I like grapes on my chicken salad. I think that's the whole point of chicken salad is there's grapes on it. I do not put celery in it though. I don't like celery. And I've got my water. It's kind of chilly out there. One, because I've it's cold inside too. Um, but the sun went away outside, and so I came in and made myself some lunch. I want to eat out there, but it's too chilly. All right, I've been trying to walk <laughs> on my treadmill, getting distracted by these guys. You're doing a fire pit tonight, correct? And they wanted to clean out the ashes. <laughs> you can leave ashes in there. Did you wipe off the outside then? Yeah. We need okay. a kitten. Someone at our bus stop had a kit in there and you should have been there to see this. Yeah, it has to be a Siberian. Matter cannot be destroyed nor created. So we do have to get rid of it at some point. Oh my goodness sakes, Jacob. You're Okay, okay. Um, and you're gonna need to move it, both of you lift it up and move it like over here so that it doesn't burn the tree. Okay. Ashley, stop. Okay, I haven't had a day like this in a long time where I'm actively trying to get steps in, I'm trying to get my miles in, and everything is getting in my way. Like, I don't know, I don't know what the deal is. <laughs> I'm like doing my walk outside because I, I got burned out from doing it inside. It's sunny, it's a little overcast, but whatever, it's warm. And I'm hot, so it feels good. But uh, <sighs> I'm not even two miles in for the total day. Well, maybe I'm at three miles, three and a half miles total. Let me turn off my, um, hang on, pause. Pause my uh, workout and get Ashley here. Um, <sighs> Ashley. Can I have to pay a play date? Let's go get them. Yeah. And I was like, oh, well we can go get everyone. Sure, my mom has nothing better to do with her time. I asked you first. You did, because one of the moms was like, she can't tonight, I can't come and get her, or I can't oh, bring her over. It. We've also been planning for like a week and been trying. Yeah. I know, you have been trying, that's why I'm willing to go. So let's go. And you can get a walk. I'm not gonna walk now. Really? <laughs> I have to go in the car. Can't yeah, walk over to their house. Uh, yeah. She drank all my drink too. Okay, let's go. Okay. Is Kaylee upstairs? Uh, no. Okay. I think she's in the kitchen. Anyway, so we have to go pick up all of her friends and uh, bring them over here to play. Luckily, the moms can um, pick them back up tonight, take them home, because I can't. Tonight's I have to leave it. Open. No, leave it open. Leave it open. I have to take Chelsea to a, um, what is it called? Activity. Well, she has an activity, but it is, it's a girls camp, like their summer camp for church. Um, but it is their kind of kickoff meeting tonight. And they get to dress up like Hawaiian 
luau style just oh, for like a fun thing. She'll win. Um, I know. So I've been talking to her about what she's gonna wear, but I have to take her to that at the church, and I don't like going clear across town and wasting the gas to go back and forth. So I'm gonna have a, one more final attempt at getting my steps in today. Absolutely ridiculous. But I love you, hey. and you're better occupied. <laughs> Would you want me to be texting you? I'm boy, can you come back? Exactly, exactly, which is why I'm going, because you might as well occupy this child of mine um, so that I can maybe come back and walk for an hour before I have to take Chelsea. That's all I'm trying to do today. Literally, it's all I have on my to-do list. Even stopping at Target and the dollar store today wasn't technically on my list. I just did it because it was on the way home. <laughs> All right, I had to um, go and lay in my bedroom for the past half hour or so because Ashley's got her friends right inside and Kaylee and all of her friends are outside doing a little fire pit snack night. And I'm hiding in the garage right now because I want a piece of chocolate and I don't want to share it with anyone. This is the good Bowen's chocolate that I got. Um, for Patty when they came into town. I got this one for Mother's Day. And I don't share when I get treats for Mother's Day. So I'm hiding in the garage, getting ready to take Chelsea and walk some more. I'm at four miles. But I need a little energy. <laughs> I can't show their faces, but they sure are noisy. They're giggly in here. And then these guys are out here being cute, having a little snack, and they think, and it's cute that they let Chelsea. <laughs> Brie watches our channel too, so hi Brie. Just drop Chelsea off. Let's see how many miles I can get around the neighborhood, over here. It's cold though, it's barely 62, <laughs> so, and the cottonwoods are in full bloom. I think my eyes are gonna start itching a ton if I start walking around in it. I mean, you can just see them. It's like a cloud of cottonwood flying around in the air. I did it. I officially got my steps and my miles in today. I got cupcakes. And I had to circle this parking lot waiting for you to come out to get to my seven miles. Let me see your cupcakes. Show me your cupcakes. You have fun? Yeah, I need water. You excited about camp? Yeah. Can I see your cupcakes? Mm-hmm. Can you hand that? You are she's such a smart aleck. I mean, I am your child, so. Yes. So it's a Hello Kitty? <laughs> drop the I'm not. It's a Hello Kitty? And a turtle. And a turtle. I think that's a turtle. I, I forgot I, what I was making I wasn't sure through. what it was, to be honest, so I just. I forgot I'm what I was making it. halfway through. So. Anyway, I am going to go. I need to make a phone call to my sister and deal with, with my one of my children at home who has a little issue with some of her friends. <laughs> oh, that one? Yeah. So I'm going to end it with you guys, but I did accomplish my workout goal today, and I will walk again tomorrow night, but I have book club, so I've got to speed walk. I've got to get my steps in, and then go home and shower and go to book club tomorrow night. So I will, someone else's house, oh. so we don't have to host it. I will talk to you guys next time. I really hope I caught that on camera. <laughs> if I didn't, she just belched. And then blew it in your face. Correct. On purpose. <laughs> right at the end of my videos, because yeah. that's her goal in life. Yeah. Just want everyone to know that that's her goal in life. Mm -mm. For my videos, yes. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good night. Okay, end it.